The Arlington might be ready to join the list of communities banning the sale of single-use water bottles. Good evening, I'm Paula Evan. And I'm David Wade. 20 different communities at this point, most of them on the Cape, have already banned the plastic water bottles. As WBZ's Zania Maldonado tells us, Arlington residents believe the move will benefit everyone. Water bottles are convenient, but are also a big problem for the environment. This plastic lasts for thousands of years. Which is why some Arlington residents are pushing to pass a ban prohibiting the sale of single use plastic water bottles. The ban would apply to any business in Arlington selling bottled water in sizes one liter or less, as well as town owned buildings such as public schools, all in efforts to reduce plastic pollution and litter. Those microplastics seeping into the ground, which, and then after the rain, uh, the rainwater carries it into our waterways, gets into the marine life cycle. Taking water bottles out of the, the waste stream could be a beneficial change, right, and, and reduce the, what we're putting into landfills. Although many are in favor, we asked the town manager if there's been any opposition to the ban. I haven't heard that there's been significant problems because it's only water being banned, right? It's not energy drinks or milk or other beverages you can buy out of a plastic bottle. It's only water. According to Zero Waste Arlington, more than 1.5 billion bottles of water and other non-carbonated beverages are sold in Massachusetts annually, and only about 20 percent get recycled. It's when plastic is thrown away, it doesn't disappear, whether it's burned or landfilled. Uh, the chemicals that made that plastic uh, just stay with us forever. More than 20 towns in Massachusetts have passed similar bottled water restrictions, and Arlington residents are eager to join the list. As a town, we can make a commitment to provide more filling stations um, and really model um, a new way of consuming water that doesn't involve plastic. Now, the town could vote on the ban as early as this Wednesday, but if passed, it would not go into effect until November. In Arlington, Zinnia Maldonado, WBZ News.